When Sean is not competing, he is busy promoting himself as a product of bodybuilding and regularly supports and attends most of the bodybuilding shows he is not in. Recently, he visited the Pro Ironman Invitational Contest in Redondo Beach, California, a show he won in 1990, and now returns to 11 years later, backstage and with a camera. Back here at the 1990 Ironman Classic. This is where I won it, the first pro show I ever won. It's the year uh, 2001. Back to visit the crime scene 11 years later. We've got a few good guys in this contest. We've got Chris Cormier, Melvin Anthony, Craig Titus, and uh, a few other interesting competitors tonight. So it's going to be kind of interesting. We've got a lot of new jacks coming up. And uh, 11 years after uh, actually winning this contest, I'm excited to see what happens. Came here to get motivated, get fire up the jets for the new bodybuilding season. Um, preparing for my 13th Mr. Olympia. I'll be going to most of the pro shows this year. Starting with the Ironman this week, San Francisco the following week, the Arnold Classic, and uh, the Night of Champions. And um, we're going to see what's going to happen building up to the Mr. Olympia. Hopefully some new guys will be able to qualify. Last year we had 12 competitors. So uh, it's interesting. Flex is sitting out these shows. Kevin Lavroni sitting them out. Ronnie Coleman decided to do the Arnold Classic. He'll be the first Mr. Olympia ever competing in the Arnold Classic. So it'll be interesting to see how things pan out. Um, he's going to have a lot of pressure. Chris sat out last year's Mr. Olympia. So he's the winner of this contest last year. And uh, he's trying to duplicate that feat after taking a year off. And it'll be interesting to see how he fares. So let's go take a look on inside, see, see what's happening backstage. I'll take you backstage. Come on. So with three spots available, we're going to find out which three out of the competition can actually nab a spot for the Mr. Olympia. This is backstage at the Mr. Ironman Hey, Sean. How you doing, old man? Nice to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. Alright? So it's qu kind of quiet back here. We've got Melvin Anthony over there. Got Ken Jones warming up over there from New Jersey. King Kamali over there. Let's find out where the other guys are. Surukabi, Wakata. What's up? I got the special. Just say hello to the fans. This is Jim Mad Mannion. Mike and Nebu I have lighting. Been. When I guess, when I pose, all the lights gonna be in the audience and nothing on stage. He's space. not gonna be posing. <laughs> this is Peter McGough, the editor of Flex Magazine. Yeah, I knew Sean when he didn't have an ego. This is Sean Ray. A long back. time ago. The guy <laughs> never talks too much, just a little bit. It's a real character. His first time we on camera. We need characters in sports. His first time yeah. on camera. Yeah. Anyway, this is backstage at the Ironman. Let's check let, check out the rest of the competitors. It's kind of dark back here. You gonna pick this up? Hey, Sean. All right. How you doing? All right. Not too bad. All right. This is it. This is the backstage area. See what happens backstage. Some of the guys they have to bring the rubber bands type stuff. They aren't actually doing a full workout. They're just trying to get the blood going through the body. As he's doing over here, warming up. Here's some other guys back in here. Come this way. What's up, Sean? All right, man. Come on in. Let's go take a closer look. Get Craig Titus over here warming up. Hey, what's up, Sean? And these are real popular. Warm up, get the blood going. Yanni Schomberger over there. You got to keep it down because these guys are concentrating. About 10 minutes they're going to be on stage flexing and squeezing with everything they got. So a lot of guys take 12, 14 weeks of preparation of dieting. They're carved up right now, and they're putting on the last minute application of oil, coloring and warming up to fill out before they come out on stage as the judges start to pick and choose the lineup. So these guys come from all over the world here. And Craig over here. How's it going, baby? You feeling good? It's good. What'd you weigh in today? 250. 250. Can I get a shot in the camera? Craig. Right on. Let's see 
Okay. Let's go over here and see what's happening. This is Jason Lawrence right here, the national champion. Tattoos are in vogue right now. Yeah, we'll explore. They all have tattoos. He's in a gang, I think. Look at the girls. They just love it. I'm changed. Watch out for the wide lens coming through. Sure. All right. Good luck. Yeah, thanks, bro. It's crowded. It's tight back here. Get gear down. You ready, baby? Mm -hmm. All right, right? Mm -hmm. Hey, what's up, Sean? Say hello to the camera, man. Mr. USA. This is what happens backstage at a pro show. You got guys rubbing you down and looking in the mirror, make sure all your oil's right. It's quiet. They give us no music, no entertainment. It's all business. There's some more guys over here. It's total serenity. <laughs> Take a look down that way. It's crowded. They give you no room back there. You got Lee Priest back there and Patrick Lynn warming up. It's every man for himself. So what happens now is in about another five or ten minutes, they're going to call for these guys to line up. They've already picked their numbers. The last thing they're doing is just getting a little bit of blood going, a lot of nervous energy in the air. And the audience out there, it's a, a packed house, and they're just sitting there in the, waiting for the athletes to come out. So the, at the actual energy will start taking place when they see the bodies on stage. And uh, as they begin to take a look at all the guys under the lighting, the cream will start to rise to the top, and we'll find out who's in great shape, who's balanced, and who's symmetrical. The judges will take a long, hard look. This process takes about two hours um, to figure out the top ten because that's all they place is the top ten people. There's probably about 30 guys in the show, so there's 20 of them that aren't going to get anything. And out of those top ten guys at place, only five will walk away with prize money. Uh, fifth place is 1,000, fourth is 2,000, third is 3,000, fourth is 4,000, and, and first place is 10. Not a lot of money, but still, you might be able to get lucky enough to get a qualifying pro, um, uh, invitation to the Mr. Olympia. So we'll see what happens. That's it. They mean five minutes, so they're not messing around. This is big. Mr. Uni Mr. USA over here, Melvin Anthony. As you can tell, he's ready, ready to do battle. Big so shot. The very last thing that they do before they go on stage is put the oil on. After that, all the work is done on stage. There's no last minute uh, secrets here. OK, this is it. So I'm going to go get my spot out front and watch the contest. And uh, we'll see you guys in San Francisco. All right, take care. Yeah, 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 yeah.